God damn, God damn, God damn. Yo, I don't know who told me to buy some more stuff. I don't know why I bought so much stuff. I don't, I don't even think y'all could see everything, but look. This is all sneakers pick up. And then right in my hand, hold on, hold on, hold on. Shopping. I have a problem, but let's get into this video. For greatness, praying that I fall, yeah, they hope that I will make it. Following the niggas with a gutty niggas brainless. Yeah, I'm a shopper, but now I'm underrated. Yeah. What's up, YouTube? How you doing? Welcome back to the page. Welcome back to the channel. Welcome back to another episode of Squin TV. Dogs, all gone. So as you see by the intro, picked up. Uh, a whole bunch of stuff. I'm talking about shoes I bought from last week, this week, and even stuff I picked up a month ago. You know my pickups, I be taking forever to post them. I have the Travis the Travis Scott sixes as you see, and look, have yet to do a review. So I'm, I'm gonna show you guys what I picked up, and you guys let me know if you wanna see a review on them. So let's get the clothing out the way and hold on, hold on, hold on. Just to let you know, this this background, this backup, everything's gonna get set up proper and right i'm gonna get a new backdrop a new whole format for you guys but right now and this is it all right all right let's jump into the clothing pickup first as everybody know kith boy kith sucker kith whore whatever you want to say whatever you want to call it if kith drops something i'm gonna pick it up i'm gonna buy it and right here we have a bow i want to say three items or is it four i don't know let's get into the bag one Two, three. So hold on, hold on, hold on. Yeah, three. It is winter time, so you know we have to start wearing sweatpants. And I didn't want to get uh the gray one in this style. This is from the Kith Fall Delivery Two collection, and it fits a little bit weird. So this is an extra small. All of Kith pants always fit baggy, so I always size down. On the left leg, you're gonna have the Kith logo with the K embroidered, and everything else is screen printed on. I needed new sweatpants and I was tired of wearing Nike Tech, so I decided to pick up this Kith uh, sweatpants. If you're interested in this, the link is down below because it's actually still on his website in the three colorways that dropped. And then he has another sweatpants that I didn't like, but you could go check that out. From Kith, we actually have this long sleeve right here. I told you guys from last year that I love long sleeves, so I'm going to be buying them no matter what. And I, never, I don't have a blue shirt. Of every color that I have, every color of the rainbow, I don't have blue. So when I seen this, I picked it up. The pants, you have the Kith logo on the left side, right by the heart, because you know I love Kith with all my heart. <laughs> These good is really heavy, so in those chilly times, in the early spring, you could throw this on and you're gonna feel nice and warm. But for the price of $88 plus tax, making it 98 or 90 something, either way, is nearly $100 for a long sleeve shirt. Would I say go get it? Yes, if you're into sports, or if, if you like Kith or want to get your hands on Kith, I'll say buy it. If not, just go to Uniqlo and buy a $15 t-shirt. It's going to do the same thing. And of course, it couldn't be a fall. It couldn't be a nice winter pickup without great sweatpants. You know, summertime come out, the female bring out the sundress. Yeah, fall, winter, the guys bring out the gray sweatpants. <laughs> hmm. Now, just like his fall collection with the olive sweatpants, I went down a size and got a size uh, extra small. They fit way better. They're nice and tapered. The one thing I love about this sweatpants is that there's no humongous Kith branding on the upper leg. It's actually all the way down at the foot. You have Kith embroidered on the left leg. And that's it for the clothing. So let's get into what you guys really want to see, which is the shoes. You see the blue SB box. You know I was looking to pick up some SBs, but unfortunately, no, it's not the laps, it's not the lobsters. Instead, whoo, I know you guys was not expecting this, neither was I. This is the Supreme and Nike SB Go To Dunk Low. My boy E Money hooked me up with these, and I have to say thank you so much because I was looking into picking up more SB lows, and this was crept right below the radar if you're trying to pick these up they are going i want to say for like 20 to 50 dollars over retail so it's not that big of a pain on your pocket however me i got it for a good price and i couldn't say no let's look at it beautiful with the supreme stitching right there i mean mm, drew swoosh gold toe box how could i say no to this another shoe that actually crept out of nowhere that's popped up on everybody's radar was these right here the LeBron 7 red carpets. Now, the OG box, the OG shoes, OG colorway. Dogs, as a LeBron fan, 
Well, I have a whole bunch of LeBron in the back. I couldn't say no, I couldn't resist. I had to pick these up. And I want I want to know, did you guys pick these up? These were actually sitting for a while, but I heard they sold out everywhere now. So did you get your hands on the LeBron 7 red carpets? Definitely go and do a review on these. But if you want to see it, please comment down below. Review the LeBrons. If you want to see the SBs, comment down below. Review the SBs. One comment, <laughs> I'll throw up a review. Now when these first came out, I was really hyped. And I'm talking about the first, first colorway. This is the NASA PGs. When they first came out in the orange, I was like, eh. They came out in the white, I was like, no. They came out in the, in the silver, I was like, dogs, what that? But when they came out in the blue, whoo, these right here is fire. I don't know, it's something about the blue that I just love having the patch in the back. Like, my lighting is bad right now. I need to get me some LD lights, cause this is bad. But here you have it. This is really not doing it any justice. Let me give you a quick B-roll. Juice for me is amazing. Like Nike basketball is really bringing people back, making them wear basketball shoes for style. But you could also look stylish on the court. That's, that's, ah, damn y'all sick. A lot of people don't like them, but me personally, I like them and that's why I picked them up. And if you want to see a review on these, please comment down. Just touch down like NASA. Mm-hmm. <laughs> if you know the song, you know the song. Now, before I get into the heavyweights, you guys already know what this is. I'm pretty sure you, you see the, you see this? Boom, but the light not, yo, move light. You see this? Yo. 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 I'm gonna get into this first though. Let's rip open this box. Shaboom. What came in the orange box? Which, which Nike collab? has an orange box. That means I had these sitting for over three weeks unopened because I want to show you guys. So here we have it. This is the Sakai Blazer. Which color? Go ahead. Go ahead. I'm gonna open it while you guys take a guess. Oh, uh, comment below. Bam! It is the white colorway and like I said, Bad lighting will take away all the beauty. So B-roll time. I feel like they should add on this a little bit more gray, you know, right here, right there. But pff, I'll get into that if you guys want to get into that in the review. Right, all right, here we go. This is what you guys really want to see, right? The two Travises. Well, yes, here we go. I got kids and men's because I'm just that nice. Sneakers app has really been blessing me, so I got two pairs. And I'm pretty sure you, you guys already know how they look like. So let me show you them again. Well, there you have it, the kids pair with both laces. Jordan, you have not let down these females. And the men's pair. Ooh, ooh, the beauty of this goddamn shoe. Dogs, this, this, ah, uh, huh. Run the B-roll. Now we're talking stash pocket on both. One, two, like, geez, like the girl them can uh, can put them Jolly Rancher, them candy, them mints, right, Chessa? And the boy them can put, you know, you know, yeah. <laughs> but yo, these right here definitely, I want to say, is a great pickup. I'm happy that I got both in hand. Both of them have like the same great quality, so I'm not going to hold you. If you guys want to see a review on these like, and on feet, please let me know. I will do that for you and I'll switch out the laces too. I am gonna put in the yellow laces in mine. I feel like that stands out a lot. Since Travis wanna, you know, give us other laces, why not use them, right? Oh, I almost forgot. Oh, uh, I picked up something yesterday actually from, as you see, Nike NYC. is actually part of the Fearless collection. No, I didn't get the shoes because I did not like it. However, this right here is fire. And I got a size large just because I wanted that oversized fit. Now the large looks big on me, I'm not gonna hold you. However, when I saw the medium, it didn't have the same bleach spots. 
in the back is limit like fears are often just an illusion this right here and then we'll fling it with the travis oh god me i got kill on him the fit i got nice <laughs> but no honestly this this was the last minute pickup and this i'll say is my favorite out of the whole thing and that's about it i'll do a review on whatever you guys comment on well as you see i have a shopping problem and i need to see a therapist but until then i'll be picking up shoes and feeling happy about it <laughs> all right love manas and respect guys and that's it i'm out Thank you.